Hello, V Team. Thanks for joining us for today's Up to Speed Live. We've got a great news rundown for you, but first we want to bring attention to an awesome event happening in Basking Ridge today. Joining us live is George Talks Tech's own George Coronius to tell us about Demo Day and all the exciting devices and services Verizon's showing off and letting employees test drive. George, take it away. Take it. Hey guys, I'm live at Demo Day in the upper cafeteria in Basking Ridge. Definitely come on down. We are showing off the best of the best in gadgets, devices. I'm here representing cloud gaming. We've got Plus Play, Fios TV Plus, FWA, Care Smart Watch. We've got the Gizmo Watch, the 5G Home. We've got Home Awareness and so much more. This is the place to be today. As you can say, it's already packed and people are psyched. So again, come down, find me, find Kelsey. We're so excited to talk about things like the new Razer at 5G. Also, today, you might check this out, Jen. We are announcing a new yellow iPhone 14 and iPhone 14 Plus. So if yellow is your jam and yellow is what you're psyched for, we have yellow and, get this, an amazing bundle offer to help get it in your hands. You can get with trading and on a select plan, you can get an iPhone 14 on us, whatever color you choose, and an Apple Watch SE and an iPad 9th generation, all on us, all on us. So go check it out. Check out Verizon.com. We have all the information. Pre-orders start March 10th. It officially launches March 16th. I am so psyched. <laughs> wow, really cool, George. Thank you so much. And yellow is the perfect color for spring. Yeah, yellow is good luck. And I heard Rita's is down there, so that's cool too. Okay, well, we need to go after yeah, this. Yeah, <laughs> this sounds like a lot. We get, to, we get to win, we get to eat, it's going to be good. Amazing. And I also heard that the Verizon Employee Resource Groups have a table, so if you've been meaning to join one of them, make sure you head down. Today is a great day to learn more and sign up. Now, moving on to other news, the network team has been busy at work enhancing the network, deploying more 5G, upgrading our fiber backhaul, adding bandwidth, and building new cell sites across the country. And due to these efforts and many additional efforts, since the beginning of the year, Verizon has been named the best network by Roots Metrics in Dayton, Ohio, Toledo, Ohio, Louisville, Kentucky, Lancaster, Pennsylvania, Omaha, Nebraska, Greensboro, North Carolina, and Temecula, California. We heard from some of our network leaders on what our upgrades and wins mean to our customers. Let's check it out. Very few people in this role get to impact over 100 million people every day. All of us in this network organization have that opportunity. What we're doing right now is an enabler for future technologies. We're enabling 5G ultra wideband, 5G nationwide. We're in the process of deploying 5G core along with our very deep fiber portfolio to allow services for any customer anywhere at any time. As we deploy that, you're going to see much higher speeds going through the network. What this means for our customers is more people can use the network, more traffic gets through. It's going to improve the latency. It really allows customers to use their apps and use the network the way they want. It also means that we can now service home customers. And now you can use broadband at home over a wireless network. We are going to continue to deploy infrastructure and stay ahead so that we maintain our position as the best network in the industry. When you combine the fiber optics network that we're deploying and the wireless 5G network, no stopping us. Very cool. And building on these upgrades, today we announced that Verizon's fast, ultra-reliable 5G ultra-wideband service is now available to 200 million people across the U.S. That's roughly two out of every three Americans. With super-fast download speeds, customers using 5G ultra-wideband across the nation can now do everything from downloading huge documents and seamlessly streaming movies and HD audio and video to playing console-quality games and conducting video chats and video conferencing calls while on the move with clearer sound and video. We continue to offer customers choice and superior services and we're not stopping anytime soon. Our engineers are working hard to continue to expand coverage and introduce 5G ultra wideband service into more rural and suburban areas. So be on the lookout for more news on how we're reaching more customers where they are.
Love it. Now, moving on to legal and security news, the Verizon Law Firm and Supplier Diversity Committee presented the inaugural Verizon Law Firm Idea Award, recognizing excellence in inclusion, diversity, and equity to Jackson Lewis, one of Verizon's law firm partners. Now, this annual award recognizes law firms that excel in promoting and fostering and leading diversity inclusions and programs within their firm and the legal industry as a whole. In addition to Jackson Lewis, Verizon recognized three other diversity champion law firms, Morgan Lewis and Brockius LLP, McDermott, Will and Emery, and Reed Smith LLP. The event featured an insightful panel discussion where we shared best practices, including programs and innovations designed to advance diversity, equity, inclusion, and belonging. Congratulations to all of those recognized. And team, a few weeks ago, we told you about our new Women's History Month series, Bring the Change, Don't Wait for It, on Inside Verizon's LinkedIn page. Well, this upcoming Thursday, March 9th, from 1 to 2 p.m. Eastern Time, our Verizon Wave Employee Resource Group will be hosting Episode 2, titled The Pathways to Success as a Woman in Tech. The panel conversation will be moderated by Vice President of Business Sales for Verizon Business, Mark Tina, and Vice President Client Services and Portfolio Management for Verizon Business, Shelly Ashwell. The conversation will feature former V-teamer Judy Spitz, founder of Breakthrough Tech, and Flora White, Managing Director of Girls in Tech. You'll also have the chance to hear from two women who've gone on to success after being a part of these two great programs. You can expect to learn what got these women into their tech careers and what resources helped them stay engaged and excited. You won't want to miss it. And also don't forget tomorrow is a special International Women's Day event right here on Up to Speed at 12 p.m. Eastern. You'll hear from women leaders from across the business who will be sharing advice on the topics you want to hear most about. So make sure you come ready with your questions. And also mark your calendars on March 10th. Check out the upcoming Disney Plus movie, Chang Can Dunk. Did you know that part of the film was shot at one of our Verizon stores? It features Chang, a high school junior who bets the high school basketball star that can, he can dunk by homecoming. The bet leads the 5'8 inch Chang on a quest to find the hops he needs to dunk in order to impress his crush, Christy, and finally gain the attention and respect of his high school peers. Check out this awesome trailer. Ah, dude, I barely recognize you. Freshman Chang is no more. Chang 2.0 is here, baby. Kobe. You seem pretty into basketball, so why aren't you out there then? Hey, Christy, this is for you. I'd rather be a loser than be just like you. Okay, yeah, you can dunk. So can a lot of people. You can't. Yeah, I could if I tried. On the night of the last home football game, I bet you I will dunk on that hoop. What are we putting down? I have a first edition Charizard Pokemon card. Shadowless. <gasps> yeah. Worth three grand. So what's the plan? This guy. She's going to teach me how to dunk. DeAndre? Hey, you said you were a basketball coach. You said you were six foot. <laughs> if Chan can't dunk by our last football game, he's going to have to move to another school. Yikes. I'll do anything you ask me to do. We're going to do a whole series on you. Yo, I'm Chang and I'm dunking on all my haters. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you were serious. I'm sorry, bro. We're going to work on that. You're home away from home. No way, just you in the bar. Was that the kid from the main? <laughs> I have 10 bucks on you dunking. Oh. Hey, don't worry. My man's got this. I haven't seen him like this before. I thought he quit after a week. Ah! Use that cord, Shane. But he didn't. Ah! Ah! He kept going. Hey! Everybody's talking about you, dude. He's 5'8". He's inspirational. Let's go. Ah! Why do you want to dunk so bad? Is it really about this bet with Matt? If I could dunk, it would be proof that I could be more than who I am.
Okay, well, that looked awesome, but what do you think? Will Chang win the bet? Remember to check out the movie on Disney Plus this Friday, March 10th, and be on the lookout for how Verizon showed up in the movie. And let us know in the comments of the VZ Web article what your favorite Disney Plus show movie is for a chance to win an awesome watch kit featuring Chang Ken Dunk branded items. And before we end today's show, we want to celebrate a special V-teamer, Michael Bray, who will be celebrating his 50th year anniversary with Verizon on March 12th. Michael's journey with Verizon started back in 1973, and he's been with the company for every stage of our evolution. Over the years, he's contributed in over 25 roles, first starting his career with directory assistance at New England Telephone. Now, Michael is a tech project manager on the site reliability engineering team. Michael, we thank you for your service and dedication to our company, and we celebrate with you today. Congratulations, Michael. Well, all right, the team, that's all we have for you today. If you haven't yet, remember to head down to the cafeteria to check out the demo day and get yourself some Rita's, because we are. Mm -hmm. So stay safe, and until next time, you're up to speed.